Hi, I'm not entirely sure where to begin with this, but this is my portfolio, with commentary obviously, as it is video. My name is Ryan Palmer, or otherwise known as Neon the Cutter. I've been making things for quite some time now, but it all really began with Little Big Planet. A lot of my work from back then had been lost, and the stuff I do have is impossible to edit really due to lost DLC from console transfers. However, the minuscule amount of stuff I have I believe was impressive for the time. I have here some pictures on the screen of some tanks that I made for a real-time strategy in Little Big Planet 1 with fully working logic self-contained within the tank itself. Unfortunately, it doesn't really play nice at the moment with Little Big Planet 3, so I don't have video of it actually doing stuff. Moving on, before I get the dreams, I'd like to show some progress I've made in Little Big Planet since the tanks were pretty old. Here I have some screenshots of a 1 versus 1 RTS in Little Big Planet 2. It wasn't really much but it worked, and it was very fun to play online. I also have some screenshots here from one of my last projects from Little Big Planet that I had to abandon. It's more of a show of game design progress more than anything. Now, let's get the dreams. I've been following dreams since the original Creative Console trailer in 2013 for the PS4. I knew exactly what Media Molecule was planning and I couldn't wait. However, I waited and waited and waited and waited and waited until it was finally available to me through the Creative Beta. Within the first few weeks of the beta, I was really preoccupied with one thing, however, because Alex, the technical director of Media Molecule, said that split screen wasn't possible and I set myself out to prove that when he said yes to everything, it meant yes to split screen as well. So I spent weeks figuring out how Dreams processes coordinates, rotations, uh, transforms, and math, and all that kind of stuff, and just grieving that it didn't have any basic mathematical functions like sine and uh, cosine, inverse trig, just stuff like that. Um, so I had to come up with that, like sign and approximation, and after a few failed attempts and methods, I was finally able to simulate a camera system and display copies of a gameplay area on two sections of the screen. I believe this was actually featured on a Media Molecule stream as well. Um, I also, we were so impressed by this. So we get asked a lot of times if there's split screen in uh, Dreams, and there there isn't, but then we noticed today that like someone is uh, working on um, like split screen in dreams and it's really really cool now what's nuts about this is obviously we don't actually have split screen so they they're turning on and off the visibility of things to make it look like they're split screen like, Alex Evans is sitting over yeah, there with a really yeah. interested maths, look on his face. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> the, the maths for this off camera. must be like bonkers you know I just can't even oh, it, held it, my it desk just, yeah. Like, whoever's making that, you're a mad, mad person. <laughs> just crazy. Uh, yeah. But well done, you. After this, I didn't really have much time left in the beta, so I didn't really do much till I heard that the beta was extended and the NDA was lifted as well. I constantly stream the game, made tutorials, and have now amassed a following of 3,000 plus people for my dreams, tutorials, and content. I have numerous tech demos and how-tos published in the game, and most of which can be seen on my YouTube channel, Neon the Coder. In the time of NDA Free Beta, I was also reached out to by Faron, leader of the most well-known Dreams creator group, MadGFX. I'm currently spending most of my time in Dreams working on projects for MadGFX, like Project Europa, in a scrap tower defense game. However, since Creator Early Access has begun, I have also put out other works within Dreams, like my Shroom Quest project demo, which is currently on hold, a Wild West jam entry, Red Dead Redemption, and Memes the Game. I have plenty more plans for Dreams and Dreams content, and I'd hope to be able to put out as much as it as possible. I have some additional photos here that I believe would show off some of my creations, so I'll go ahead and put those up now, but I hope that whoever's watching this uh, thinks of me as a good creator. Thank you. Bye-bye.